Lux Beer Review is back again in another episode of Baz the Beer Swirls. This is a show where we review beer amateur style. Sure. And sure. that may be saying a lot. Right yeah. There. Uh, anyways, uh, he's Dan. Uh, I'm Mike. Dan, no, <laughs> what are we drinking? Uh, Mike, <laughs> we have... And yeah. This is, I would say, an historic, historic beer. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. For the wrong reasons. Sort of. yeah, yeah, I know. For uh, sad reasons. Okay, so I'll show you the can. So this is from K2 Brewing and Young Lion Brewing. K2 uh, out of Webster, New York, and uh, Young Lion, they are out of Canandaigua, New York. This is called the Lion's Den, and it is a hazy the New Lions. England style. New Den. India Pale Ale in 16 ounces. And uh, 6.5 ABV, 15 IBUs, SRM of 3, because why not? Yes. Um, so, yeah, the Lion's Den is a collaboration Lions. between New K2, Den. Brothers Brewing Company, oh, and Young Lion Brewing Company. Uh, this hazy New England IPA marks a special moment as K2 Bre Brothers Brewing proudly provides a brand new home to the Young Lion brand. Oh. Dry hopped with Citra and Mosaic, Yum. this easy drinking beer won't last long on your shelves or in the fridge. Um, yeah. yeah. So, what happened, Mike? What happened with the Young, young Lion? Uh, they decided to uh, call it quits. K2 Brothers uh, bought their recipes and uh, everyone's favorite local family-owned brewery will be moving into their old digs down by uh, the lake in Canandaigua, hopefully providing everyone with all the cans of beer they <laughs> desire. Uh, but this was kind of like a, a going-away beer. Yeah. Um, hence why it says the Lion's New Den. Oh, is that? I keep pointing out oh. for the third time. Uh, I wonder why you kept interrupting <laughs> me like that. Yeah. Um, so... It is kind of a bittersweet beer. Like, you know, we, we've had our go-rounds with Young Lion. What you if know? they purposely made it bittersweet? I got one. I got one of those suckers. See? Um, Things are I get this okay. dang aloe plant over here. <laughs> Apparently, it's got these, like, weird bugs from, like, soil. I don't know. It's weird. Uh, yeah, anyways. Uh, yeah, other half bought the old tap room and uh, brewing capacity. Yep. Young Lion swooped in and... Uh, or other half swooped or in. Other half swooped and in. K2 and then K2 swooped, swooped in. in. Yeah. And bought their uh, IP. So yep. basically the 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 logo, the brand, the recipes. Uh, and they, they should be brewing some more beer under the Young Lion label uh, out of their massive Chuck E. Cheese, Dave & Buster's style <laughs> playground facility out there in Webster. So uh, it it looks like a murky, uh, dulled orange. It is a murky orange, isn't it? A little, little bit of foam on top. A little murky. Um, it looks good. Looks Looks like a hazy IPA. Hmm. Ooh, a little, uh, there's a little bitter orange in there, but there's a, a spice to it, like a peppery. Yeah, it's kind of full, uh, <sighs> spicy. Yeah. The peppery. Oh, a zing, if you will. It's, it's, uh, the aroma's like a little subdued and it's that subdued where it's like, oh, I think it's going to explode a little bit on the palate. This is an entry level aroma. It All smells right. light. Take a <laughs> Cheers. It's very light, spritzy, summery. Wow. So that's citrus zesty. That's a heavy kind of malt. That's like a honeycomb, honeycomb cereal malt. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's the last time you had honeycomb? Do they even make that cereal anymore? They do. Honeycomb was so good. Like I loved honeycomb. That that <sighs> yeah, definitely um, crackery kind of bready wheat, but mm. more like the sweet cereal kind of honey Cheerios, honeycomb, uh, that kind of aspect. But then there's like this uh, kind of underlying bit of like a almost like tangerine. I don't, I don't think it's straight orange. Yeah, I, I think it's more of a, a tangerine cuties kind of Kool-Aid uh, fruit to it with, dare I say, a bit of a bit of lemon in there as well. I think that's where the zest might be coming in for me. It's got that earthy kind of really, really dirty, like soily kind of pineapple in a ground kind of mm. thing. Yeah, okay. Um, I can't get past like 
like the weedy kind of malt forward. Okay. Base. Yeah, you're hankering on that, aren't you? Yeah, it is. Like, is it that pronounced for you? Um, I think I, I, it's there, uh, but the, the honey Kool-Aid citrus is, is popping for me. Along with that really nice spritzy level of carbonation. I, I 6.5. Makes it. Body. Yeah. It's there. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm okay with it. The, with the body, I I, I like it. Uh, I think it makes it easily drinkable. What do you want to say about the alarm? I saw I saw the look. You saw the look. You know he's got he's got things thinking. Just checking off another video. <laughs> oh, the streak continues. Oh. Uh, this is... Mike says I'm easily distractible during uh, videos. The evidence is there. It's all documented. Now I'm drinking it. It is getting more fruity. Mm -hmm. Like when I first started, I was like, yeah, it's not too fruit forward. But now it's really popping up there. I think they... Did we talk about mouthfeel? Carbonation? I did. No one listened. I know. Very selective here. It, it's a subtle carbonation. If my voice sounded like... You'd go, what's that? Things to say? What's going on? I think I'd understand that more. If my face... It's just a tablet screen. He's looking at it right now. It's, <laughs> it's like just subconscious at this point. It's awesome. Uh, Talk to me about the mouthfeel and carbonation, Dan. We'll see if it echoes my thoughts. <laughs> I enjoy this beer. I, I think they, I think they nailed it. I, think, I really do too. I think uh, they nailed it. Uh, like is it. it my favorite beer from Young Lion or K Two? See, here's the thing. So it's brewed and canned by Young Lion and untapped. It's from K Two. I don't know. I I think it was the the last beer they yeah. did. Um, I think it's delicious. I, I think it's one of the better uh, Young Lion beers. I, I really enjoy it a lot. I really hope they carry on with some of the, the classic uh, Young Lion beers. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I don't know why they wouldn't. I mean, you, I mean I'm sure they'll do some new things. I mean, yeah. K2 does some wacky things. <laughs> jalapenos are going to start showing up in all the Young Lion beers. Listen, I love, the, I love the jalapeno cream ale. <laughs> I know you do. All right. Uh, what do you uh, rate it? Uh, I'm going to give this a, a solid 4.05. Yeah, I'll give it a solid 4. Oh. Um, yeah, it's really good. Um, we're looking forward to seeing what K2 does with the Young Lion. Yeah, I mean, you should really stop over there. We, we got to get we over there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, dude, they got, so they bought the old, um, I think it was the old middle school yeah. over in uh, Williamson? No, Marion. Possibly. Somewhere there. I can't remember. They yep. basically bought a school and turned it into a, a Dave & Buster's. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. It's, out of it's like the non-corporate Dave & Buster's. <laughs> yeah, it's nuts. I, I think they want to do like, uh, oh my God, they should make like, have the tickets come out of the machines when you win them and you turn in the tickets for beer. These are free ideas. Free ideas. I feel like we're going to go then. Like, no, we came up with that already. That, that, that was already ours. But, like, on the ticket, they could put, like, they could put, like, uh, the beers on them. Like, the beer type. Like, okay. Like, the ticket can be, like, many labels. Yeah. And you got to collect so many of that label to get that beer. Yeah. Because then, like, you have to build them, so if you only get one ticket and it's this part of the label, that's all the beer you get. <laughs> so if you want but, a full pour, you better be playing some games and get all you the could, labels. You could insert like the golden ticket in there. If you get the golden ticket, you, you get, get a full pour. <laughs> no, you, you get you get like a free four pack. Take home. Any four pack of your choice, take home. But the golden ticket, it's like it's rare. Sure. I mean if they're not doing a version of the tickets and prize counter, well, they're fucking up. I'm just saying. Just you like, could like, you could do your, all your merch, right? Yeah. Glassware, t-shirts, hats, stickers. Oh yeah, t-shirts is a thousand tickets. You know, glassware is fifteen hundred tickets. It. I mean, if they're not doing that, I'll be, I'd be pretty disappointed. And then there's like the pocket knife comb. <laughs> like you gotta have a pocket knife comb. Don't even get me started on bingo. I'd love to have <sighs> bingo. Bingo at K two. We gotta go out there. We really gotta go out there. The the bingo stampers yeah. like. 
The K2 and Young Lion logos. <laughs> Is that the, that the point we're getting to in life? We're like, man, all those games sound fun, but you know what would really be great? Bingo. I'd love to sit there and just stamp some bingo cards and get some beers. Combing my beard with my pocket knife comb. I feel like that's a direct shot towards me, and I don't appreciate it. <laughs> Why'd you just look at the screen? I didn't look at the screen. I was just, like, turning my head this way. You will. There you go. See? That's so bright. Why does it get so bright all the time? <laughs> all right. We got to go. Uh, yeah. Did we rate this? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's been a long time. We did. All right. Uh, <laughs> down in the description, all the links. Uh, <laughs> hey, special shout out. I doubt you watch this long, but if you watch this long, special shout out to Adam and crew over at K2. Um, it was still really cool hang out with Adam and them at, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. at the um, Beer Expo. Yep. Uh, so yeah. Uh, and as far as Young Lion cool. goes, friggin' shout out to Mike, Michael Rich Music on YouTube. We'll link him down there. Always a, a good pal. Make some good beats. Don't forget, you've said, that, you've said that before, then I've watched it and you're like, oh, the link's not there. Too busy looking at off-screen cameras. All right, gang. Uh, let's uh, go ahead and get out of here. Don't forget, be hoppy. Cheers.